This video is sponsored by Skillshare. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you three great ways that you can use everyday materials, the stuff you've got knocking around, to create awesome geometric circle art. And you don't need to use a compass. Hello, and for those of you who don't know me yet, I'm sure there's loads who don't. My name is Art John, I'm an artist and an educator, and this channel is all about sharing art ideas with parents and teachers. And if you think art is important, particularly in education, then this channel is for you. I'm gonna be using coloring pencils, but if you don't have them, you can use a regular pencil, pen, or felt tips, whatever you have. And for the first art activity, I need to draw around something circular. So I'm gonna use a simple two pen coin. Try to use the biggest coin from your country, obviously in size, not monetary value, but if you don't have a coin, you can use anything that's circular to draw around. And like I said before, I'm going to use colour pencils, and the colours I'm going to use are the colours of the rainbow spectrum. Those are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, for which you can just use a dark blue, and purple, or as it's sometimes known, violet. Now it's really simple to remember the colours of the rainbow spectrum using a simple mnemonic, Richard of York gave battle in vain, which is all about the death of the Duke of York in the Battle of Wakefield in 1463, which funny enough took place in a castle which is about five minutes away from where I am stood right now. To begin, grab something circular to draw around. A plate or an old CD will do. Place your coin on the inside edge of the circle, then draw around it with the colour of your choice. If like me you're using rainbow colours, then start with the red. Move the coin along just a little bit, then draw around it again. Keep doing this all the way around and change your colour as you go. Easy. So for this activity we're going to make a parabolic circle, which is where you create a curve using straight lines. You'll need a pencil, a ruler, your colours and an old CD or DVD. Draw around your CD or DVD, then use your ruler to mark 1cm points all the way around. Choose any starting point, then draw a line to any other point on the circle. Then move up one point and down one point on the other side, then draw another line. Continue this pattern all the way around the circle, changing your colours as you go.
you will get different designs depending on which point of the circle you choose. So this is the bit where I talk about this video sponsor, which is Skillshare. Now Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creative and curious people. It can help you explore new skills, deepen existing passions and get lost in a world of creativity. There are loads of topics that you can discover and explore such as animation, creative writing, painting or filmmaking. Now I'm going to be making more YouTube tutorials about how to make sculpture, but sculpture is notoriously difficult to film and photograph, particularly when it comes to lighting. And that's why I was really pleased to find this class by Tabitha Park. It's called DIY Studio Photography Lightbox and Demo. Now lightboxes can be pretty pricey and I really liked how she demonstrated how easy it is to make one using everyday materials but with the same professional results. Now Skillshare is curated specifically for learning which means that you won't find any adverts but they are always launching new premium classes which means you can follow your creativity wherever it may take you. It's less than $10 a month with the annual subscription and for the first 1,000 of my subscribers who click the link in the description box below you're going to get a free trial to a premium membership so you can explore your creativity. It's not bad is it? This looks hard, but is actually really simple. You will need your colour pencils and the same old CD or DVD. Mark a point in the centre of your paper. This is your anchor point. Place your pencil onto the anchor point and push the CD against it. Draw around it until you reach the starting point. Then firmly keep your pencil on the anchor point and move your CD slightly making sure it is still touching your pencil. This will help keep the structure to the drawing. Keep doing this all the way around until you reach where you started. And make sure you change your colours as you go. I'm changing mine every five circles. If this was your kind of thing, then make sure you subscribe and press the like button, it helps more people see the video. I'll see you in the next one.